Hey YouTubers, Terry here. I am um, not at my usual spot. I'm actually visiting my family in California. Um, normally I am in the Pacific Northwest in Seattle area. Um, but I wanted to, um, I did get to do a little bit of hauling and wanted to share some things with you. I am making, one of the things I'm doing while I'm here is making a quiet book for my grandson. Um, I have a three-year-old grandson on the autism spectrum and we're trying to find things to uh, uh, occupy his time productively. And I needed um, to copy off um, these color things and the pattern book um, said to use these Avery fabric transfers. And um, so I went to Staples and these are not cheap. I don't know if you ever used them, but for eight of them, um, I think it was eight of them. It was like $16. So like $2 a sheet. So you would use them sparingly, I guess. And um, so these are the two pages that I had to print off. And then I just, uh, you iron them onto your um, fabric uh, that I'm using for the quiet book. Um, I needed some rings for the quiet book. So these were $3.50 for 16 of them, but I like them because they're kind of metallic color. And I need to use them in a couple of places. And then um, I'm going to do all the little pieces with a sticky back Velcro. And they had this um, for $9.99, but it's for 75 of them. So, but totally, you may not want to know that. But um, I did go to um, Joanne's and found some, some good buys. Um, and sorry, it's hard when you're holding it with your hand. Um, I got these perler beads to take home, but they were 97 cents for the green and white and uh, really pretty green, green and green. And then um, for my my grandson really loves to play with beads, so I'm going to use these. These were on clearance for 97 cents. And I'm going to figure out something and then these were a dollar. So for him to do um, with beads in the quiet book. And um, the um, oh, sorry. You saw my lunch. Um, I um, Quiet book um, my daughter got um, online. Um, she purchased from Etsy. So if you could just go on Quiet Books, this one's called, um, it's actually called Where's Max? Um, but my grandson, they, they have a dog named Leo. So this is the cover page. Um, it's almost done, it's not quite done. Um, it has eight pages and it's darling and the, the the dog and a bone hides all throughout the book and this is removable so this dog kind of travels with the pages and stuff and there's places for him to hide so that is my purpose of doing this I've decided that um, for all the work that this is I want it to stay nice and I'm going to I just got a bandana and I'm going to make a um, storage bag for it. Um, and this was $3 at Joann's. Um, one of the pages in the quiet book um, is a laundry basket. And you needed some fabric to, um, that's kind of tucking out of the laundry basket. And so I got these three fabrics. I just got an eighth of a yard of these three fabrics. Um, so they came out to like 84 cents each and and then um this weekend well i don't know starting today um there's a 25 percent off friends and family your entire purchase and it, it did include um it doesn't say it on the coupon but it included clearance um also she told me so um so these were like 84 cents each and then I got 25% off that. 
So um, all of these prices that I gave you, um, you'd take 25% off that. Um, this was, I'm going to be doing some Mickey cards, mini cards, and I just kind of wanted a selection of um, uh, Disney stuff. And this was normally, I think $5, but it was 30% off. But then you get the 25% off that. So I don't know how much it ended up being, but um, pretty good price. They are um, mink. Um, most of it was on clearance, not all of it. So this one was 97 cents. And these are um, the letters that you run through. Um, and uh, you foil them with your laminator or with the mink machine. But I use my laminator. These were, um, there's quite a bit of them here. There's 55. So these were $1.97 each. Um, and there was others I didn't get because I didn't think I'd use them. And these were, these are um, card making set, card set. It makes um, eight cards. And so that was um, $1.97. I got two of those. Just like I got two of the alphabets. And then the other stuff I got from Mink was, these are labels um, that you run them through. And these were 97 cents. And this is basically, it's just the paper with the toner on it. So you could die cut any shape you wanted. Um, I imagine I could put it in my Cricut. Um, I don't know why not and cut out whatever shape I wanted. Um, and then foil it. Um, yeah. So um, this was 97 cents, I'm pretty sure. Okay, these little paper packs, Studio G, normally a dollar, they were 30% off. And then I got 25% um, more off of that. So, so 70 cents and then 25 off of that would be, I don't know. Yeah, so cool. 17 cents off of that. So I got two of those because I thought they were really cute. And um, for the quiet book, um, I got some felt. This is really cute. And just some just regular felt. Nothing too exciting. Um, I had already gotten these Velcros, and these are a little bit smaller and clear, so I will keep those on hand for my quiet book. They're, um, all their open stock paper was um, $2 for 10 sheets, so 20 cents a sheet. But then when you take the 25 off of that, there was 15 cents. And this is glittered, um, I don't know if you can kind of see it, but yeah, you can. Glittered, but it's basil, kind of um, feel to it. It's coordinations, oops. Oh, sorry, this is kind of a, that's the brand. Um, so I just picked up whatever colors they had, but it's really pretty. It's not your typical glitter paper. There's a bright green and a pink. Got two of each. I got four white. It's kind of pretty. And this is not glittered. This is a really pretty kind of gray black. It's really pretty. For 15 cents a sheet. There's a real dark blue. There's a Kelly Green like. There's an orange. It doesn't look orange, but it is orange. 
Oh, trying to, sorry. And then this is like a burgundy. So I got those. And that is it for Joann's. So I'm going to stop and I'm going to come back because I visited a Tuesday morning. Thanks.